everyone. It is the ultimate money show again. I am Okwe Emi Kalejaye. Today, we'll be talking about the recently released Half Year Financial Report of Lafayette Cement on the Nigerian Exchange. The company, which is one of the largest cement companies by market capitalization, released a 32% increase in profit after tax in the first half of 2022 to 37 billion naira. This is from 20 billion naira released last year. This is the highest so far. The whole of this profit is to be attributed to its shareholders. Likewise, its share price went up by 4% to 25 naira from the beginning of the year till date. Revenue also grew by 28% to 187 billion naira in the first half of 2022. This is coming from 145 billion naira reported in the same period last year. Now, analysts have attributed this revenue growth to a 28% increase in the proceeds from cement and a 45% increase in the proceeds from aggregate and concrete sales. According to analysts, the proceeds were bloated by higher product prices. Business day analysis to evaluate the efficiency of the company in creating profit shows that its profit margin in this period stood at 20%. However, the firm's cost of sale grew faster than the revenue growth, up 33% to 79 billion, while there was a year-on-year -year decline in production fixed cost, down 20% to 11 billion naira. The significant increase in production variable cost, up 52% to 59 billion naira. Maintenance fixed cost, up 38% to 8.4 billion naira, drove the increase in cost of sales. Analysts believe inflationary pressures on key materials and foreign exchange devaluation impacted dollar price input and spiked costs. Given the robust revenue growth, gross profit still grew significantly. Hence, with an average target price of 15 naira per share, analysts recommend a buy rating for Lafayette Cement. Be sure to consult your investors before making a decision to either buy, sell, or hold the Lafarge stocks. And that will be all on the Ultimate Money Show this week. I remain Okoye Mikalejai. Have fun today.